Ooh, honey, I did it. I did my makeup today because I woke up totally busted. <laughs> this is me. Good morning. Y'all, are y'all ready for a get ready with me? Just a two in one. Let's do the hair. We're going to do some makeup. And I got a cute dress I'm putting on, but I did not show you the full look. So I'm upset with myself. I'm starting out with my hair. It's already dry. I washed it last night. And I am just simply using my pattern, this little cream, along with some smooth and shine to get my hair all styled up. I'm going to link everything below so I won't be talking about everything because I really just want to talk through the video because I just want to. It's been a minute, okay? And now this is just a little DIY of mine that I use for my hair, which includes about three products, which I'll have them individually linked below. But y'all excuse any noise you hear in the background. Those are my dogs. In case you were wondering, all three of them, they are happy, great, and full of energy. So they're doing great. Now you know. But if they talk on top of me talking or maybe that's bark on top of me talking you understand what's going on okay now i'm still trying to work with those beauty what do you call them pattern beauty products hair products i'm trying because i spent my money on it and i'm going to use them the best i can how i can when i can so if you see me picking those up in this video that is the reason why they are not all that great for my hair you know it doesn't take anything expensive for my hair i promise you my hair is not bougie it will take some simple stuff and be just fine but we're going to work with that stuff as long as I have it in my hands, if you know what I mean. But anywho, just spending a little time getting this hair together. I'll have to do a little bit more after I finish my makeup. But right now, you know, we're just trying to get all the products in it. So I don't have to carry those out of the bathroom before we hit the beauty room. But how are y'all doing? How's everybody doing? Are y'all excited about the holidays? Talk to me down in the comments. Listen, introduce yourself as you always do. Let me know where you're chiming in from. I'd love to know. Y'all, let's go hit this beauty room right about now and get this whole thing going on. We get to, get, gotta get this face together. So right about now, I was just kind of clearing out some of the product that was left in my hair. Don't want any drips and all that stuff and making sure around the edge of my hair, it's not greasy or any gel or any product left there. So that's what I do when I initially get ready to sit down to do my makeup. Just checking the edges of the hair, making sure everything is in order. And we gotta have the earrings. You know I love my earrings. These gold chunky hoops. I got them from Amazon. Y'all already know. I, I love me some Amazon. That's where I find everything. My daughter always tells me, Mama, you never get out the house. I love being at home. I have everything I need and ever wanted right here with me. So why I gotta get in the streets? I always ask her. I don't have to get in the streets. I can do what I do what I do right here girl earrings on we're gonna put some moisturizer on the face i've already moisturized once but this one also contains an spf of 25 which you gotta have it and i am on some something on my tablet i'm watching youtube or something so if you see my eyes shifting over that's what i'm doing you know just passing the time seeing what's happening and all of that probably watching my favorite youtuber one of my favorites is maddie maddie's glam life y'all go check her out she's been dropping some bangers back to back during vlogmas so y'all check out her channel and honey you'll be glad you did that's my baby girl maddie's glam life so now just picking this hair up a little bit this is going to be a long video y'all so sit back and just hang out with me because i'm not really speeding it up i may cut some things out of it but you know y'all don't want to see me digging in my nose and all that stuff like that but <laughs> other than that uh, i'm i'm not cutting a whole lot out of it but uh i'm just getting this this face done 
uh, my e.l.f. Poreless Primer. I've been using this. You know, when it comes to primers, I don't really have to use a primer. I don't really know if I just have picked up the right primer, but I just kind of use whatever I have. Just because I have it, I use it. So this really doesn't do much because by the time I put on moisturizer and sunscreen and all that stuff, I got enough on my face. It's already primed. That's what I feel, but that may just be me. So what do you think about it? I don't want to, you know, put too much on my face where my makeup is sliding off because I actually already put oil in my foundation, so I don't really need a lot. Now this little dress I have on, it is like a bodycon kind of dress. It fits all the way down. It is uh, a longer dress, not a maxi or anything, but it goes past the knee if it wasn't too tight. <laughs> but it's tight. I bought it a little bit smaller. I should have probably got an extra large and I got a large, but you know, it fits, but it's just tight. Now what I'm trying to bring in focus right here is my eyeshadow primer from Fenty Beauty. And it just didn't seem like it wanted to act right whatsoever, but it's all good. It's all good. We're going to let it do what it do and be all right with it however it flows over here today because, again, we're just trying to get ready to get cute so me and hubby can get out on the town since my daughter says I never get out. So I just want to try to get a little cute. You know what I'm saying? And I love getting cute, actually. I know I work most of the time. And, honey, I work probably most of the time in my robe as y'all probably see I have tons of robes that I work in that I you know when I'm doing treatments and doing my treatments and all of that you know that's what I do now I have to retract on what I just said that I wasn't gonna cut out much but obviously in this video I can see I was doing a lot of like goofing off because I wasn't even thinking about the camera most of the time I'm just trying to do what I do so I'm using my Amazonian clay full coverage foundation from Tarte and I'm just mixing my oil in it in this video I'm using jojoba oil I use a different kind of oil couple of times a week when I do my makeup so that's what I do these full coverage and matte foundations are just so so drying on my mature skin that I love to mix the oil to really make it more of a loomy kind of effect I like the luminosity and I think I'll eventually buy only only those foundations once I you know weed out these and kind of use these up because honey my skin don't don't like all that heavy heavy coverage I just like to lightly spread it on to cover up a few of my imperfections and keep it pushing but I don't have to put a whole mask on just a little some some to cover up some things and let me have my day like done that's it but anywho back to this dress it is from Amazon as well. I have a couple of these kind of styles, which I think are just so much easy to, like when you're thinking about an outfit or something, instead of trying to select a top and pants, top and skirt and mix and match and all that stuff, you grab a dress, put you some shoes, purse, and head out the door. You're good. You, that's all you gotta do. And of course, that's hubby poo. He's gonna run out for a second. Now he run out all the time. And I say, what do I need? Let me think, let me think. And I tell him what I need. And that's about it. Other than that, honey, I'll be at home. But I will be out this particular evening with him. Um, you know, just have a little, little drinky drink or, you know, a little us time. That's about it. But honey, right about now, right about now. I think the foundation should be about done, girl. Leave it alone. Leave it alone. It's, it's on there for real. All right, well, this must be a tart day because I'm going to use my shape tape to go ahead and uh, uh, highlight under my eyes and all of that jazz. I think I'm going to also use this one to clean up my brows when I do. I try not to do too much of the highlighting, concealer, and all of that under the eyes because it don't work, as I'll soon find out at the end of this video that it just really just is too much for, again, if you have aging skin everything doesn't work and I went to rinse out my sponge and that's what that little cut there was 
and uh yeah but y'all i have been enjoying hanging out on sugar fingers a little bit more it does get a little bit more tedious over there on beauty by sweet angel especially when i you know decide to accept more sponsorships and things like that over there it gets pretty pretty hectic it gets pretty pretty hectic excuse me and um you know I kind of have to neglect my other channels but I really love the makeup and I really love you know doing more things with fashion so I will be balancing it out I do have a schedule that I'm putting on the other channels right now on Beauty by Sweet Angel it is every day every day you'll be getting a video either at 10 a.m. or 11 a.m. on I think it's Thursday and Friday or Friday and Saturday it may be 10 a.m. that the video will go up on Beauty by Sweet Angel but all other days it's 11 a.m. and also on the vlog channel Life behind the scenes with Sweet Angel and Mike. You'll catch us at 3 p.m. on Thursdays. So I've decided just to do like a weekly recap of everything that I've been doing the week, which isn't a whole lot. So you won't get a whole lot, but at least you'll be able to see both he and I, or me and him, or him and I, or somewhere along the lines, me and him, or him and I, one or the other, on that channel on Thursday so that's how you catch up with what we're doing around this house and on sugar fingers right now I'm just trying to get in the flow because it'll probably be a schedule more like a Sunday Tuesday Thursday kind of thing but right now I'm still up in the air about it because dependent upon content I have oodles of videos that I have in store for y'all however it's just a matter of, again, I'm not going to overwork myself. I just want to balance it out. And if I'm getting ready, it's pretty easy to go ahead and do the videos I have outlined over here because I can show you and talk to you. And it's more of a show and tell kind of channel that I can get those things accomplished and uh, my beauty hauls and things like that. So we're going to map it out. I do believe there's going to be some fashion videos coming up. I don't know if it'll be before Christmas or after Christmas. I'll have to just kind of wiggle it in however I can get it in right now and uh, we'll work from there. So there we go. Now you know what the setup is. Just again, just laying it all out. I am hitting these brows right about now. For some reason, I tried a different pencil, I think, on here. And she don't want to act right. You know, she don't want to go on just kind of having to do some real, you know, I don't know, Crayola crayon kind of stuff going on here. And you know, that's how you have to do it. Sometimes you have to step back and take a look at it, girl. Is it right? If it ain't right, then you need to fix it and get it taken care of. Because sometimes things don't be right <laughs> but anywho I'm getting the brows on and of course I'm out of frame as always that's why I really stopped I think I talked about this before that's why I stopped doing makeup tutorials because you know if you can't see and you got to get all on top of that mirror you know it really defeats the purpose of trying to do a tutorial so mine are just makeup looks I mean I'm not showing anybody how to do anything because I don't really know how to do everything myself so I'm just kind of you know letting you see me put some makeup on that's about it but if I'm teaching you something that's a surprise because I don't think I can do all that but I am going to leave these brows alone and uh, move on to something else just kind of brushing out the front of them so it can have that gradient effect and I'll move on to I guess maybe is it eyeshadow time no let's clean up the brow let's get that heart shape tape back and clean them up and I don't know if everybody who hangs out with me over here knows that I am a singer saxophonist on the blues circuit there's my dogs again hey y'all but um, I am right now things are really really quiet in my neck of the woods for me so I'm taking this time out to do some writing so I will have some new music coming out in 2022 I hope everybody will check it out over there on my music channel sweet angel live and uh hey buy some sweet angel music during the holidays or 
well, not during the holidays because the holidays will be over when that stuff comes out. But hey, you can still buy my old music. I actually have a Christmas song that I've had. Oh my God, I did that one so many years ago. But I'll link it below. I'll try to remember to link it below. If I don't, somebody remind me in the comments to put my Merry Christmas, my baby song in the uh, description box, okay? So you can check it out. But anywho, anywho, I'm cleaning up these brows right now. Of course, big concentration, or I might just be goofing off trying to get the next video playing over there. Who knows what I'm doing? Yeah, it looks like I was spending a little eye time over there on that tablet watching YouTube. But that's okay. I understand when y'all watch YouTube, I understand. Because I do the same thing too. I have my favorite folks I love to watch or listen to. Or, you know, I love, you know, inspirational kind of folks. People I can learn something from on YouTube. I don't like all the mess and the crap and all that stuff. I'm too old for that. Way too old for that. But, anywho taking my little sponge this real technique sponge is my favorite beauty sponge to use it is soft it is easy to operate it's the right size but some of them are too stiff too bulky all of that jazz and some of them are just too expensive beauty blender that's what i'm talking about beauty blender honey can't handle it not at all so right here i'm just taking my fenty beauty powder face powder and it's a loose powder i'm just going to set my eyelids and the only part that i probably will speed through is the eyeshadow application because that will probably be the longest part of this entire process because honey i'll be trying to get that ass shadow on and it don't be it don't always be going like i want it to go i be seeing some different eye looks and y'all it don't work for me sometimes it just don't work for me but everything is not for everybody so we gotta understand that and i do i understand it very much so okay looks like it is eyeshadow time my ghost pepper palette i just recently got this one and is this Juvia's place i can't remember no 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 it's bh cosmetics that's where i got this one this one is bh cosmetics but i got it from ulta i do believe or online y'all know i have not been into the store i have not so i ordered it from online and uh i like it but it's not what i thought it would be you know or maybe like i said i just don't know how to create the looks that i really really want and i bought this color that i was putting on right here it's more like a almost like a hot kind of pinkish reddish something i thought it was going to be kind of like a rusty looking red i don't know but anyway just me and my thinking that's it i'm going into the jaclyn hill palette this one of course was one of my favorite palettes ever 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 it's always handy and y'all since i moved the makeup on the side where my vanity is duh like that's where it should have been anyway i love doing my makeup because everything is right here at my hands i don't have to go across the room to get it love 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 that and honey that makes all the difference in the world it does and i get to use a, a bigger variety of my makeup because i used to put out the makeup of the week that i was gonna wear and then i rotated out week after week but now i just grab this grab that or whatever so that worked out beautifully and y'all know if you haven't been on my channel for a long time this room is actually was our dining room and we never dined in here y'all but now that it's the beauty room it gets used we never sat in the dining room to eat we would eat in the living room in front of the tv in our bedroom it didn't matter we just did not utilize the room so i make use of it now so if you ever hear kitchen clanking pots cooking mic in the kitchen singing or whatever then that's why you hear all of that because this 
is right by the kitchen which is great for me when I'm doing my treatments and all of that I have access to the kitchen the sink and the running water all of that which is perfect instead of it being in a bedroom which I would have to walk out of there either go to a bathroom or go to the kitchen to use some water to rinse off my face yada yada all that stuff so it works out perfectly and now eyeshadow galore i'm still in that ghost pepper palette for right now just doing a little this little i don't know underneath my eyes a little shimmery kind of eyeshadow i've been doing that a lot lately but it kind of rubs away by the by the end of the day it's no longer there but i like to kind of jazz it up juice it up but girl i want to just get cute i wanted to get cute and i wanted to uh you know show y'all what I did on this makeup all of these little palettes will be listed below but this is a Juvia's Place palette I love the black eyeshadow in here it's super pigmented and I it's one of my favorite ones outside of the I think it's a little black opal eyeshadow duo that I have those these two are the most pigmented black eyeshadows that literally will stay on all day which I love that I love that but anyway I'll link these this and that and the other all down below it may take me a minute to get to everything because I've talked about so many products but I will have it out there pretty soon so I don't know what kind of eyeshadow look this this turned out to be but I tried to do something okay and that's why it's difficult for me to film my eyeshadow looks anytime I don't film makeup on point when I do film oh my goodness I be creating some crap that I never would have thought of had I not been in front of this camera <laughs> it'd be some stuff that I don't know and I really think I look cute too girl I'm like looking all in the camera like oh y'all like this ugly but anywho that's the way we do it y'all didn't say anything about all of my christmas decoration in the background girl i tried to do a little something something back there to make it festive in the back you know what can i say oh shoot it's mascara time <laughs> this is about over it's about done this is a wrap it's a wrap when you put the mascara on it is pretty near over for sure don't y'all forget to subscribe to this channel now. Y'all were coming in hard and heavy, and now you kind of done slowed down. I need you back over here telling all your friends to go, go and subscribe to Sugar Fingers. It's an old chick doing makeup, fashion, hauls, hair, blah, 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 all of that. All of that. Tell them to come on through. Yes, indeed. I put my mascara on. I forgot that I had not put my my eyeliner on my eyeliner pencil but you know we can do it anytime it don't matter whenever it comes up just just get her done <laughs> that's me get her done oh now go back into the mascara oh my gosh y'all right about now my hand is itching oh my mom used to say oh it's your right hand you're gonna get some money i'm ready for it i'm ready for it my new way to contour using my little wet and wild contour stick here which is super easy it's a cream so it's not dry but most times I will go over it with a bronzing powder or something like that but I'm not sure if I did that this time around or not but sometimes I do sometimes I don't and I, I, I just retracted on everything I said earlier I was gonna speed up the rest but this thing is sped up because girl it takes a lot to talk through a whole video I don't have that much energy anymore now if I was mad and that mad it could talk up a storm I have to like put the mute button on her I just literally have to just close the door in her face to stop her from talking because that girl can talk oh my god but y'all make sure you go check out her channel because I promise you you will be glad you did she is 19 but I swear that girl is full of wisdom I guess because her parents were old what you think <laughs> She is totally, totally beyond her years when it comes to understanding of things, and I love that. Yes, I do. But honey, I'm whipping it on down now. I'm putting on the blush, the highlighter, the bronzer. Sure am. 
We're getting ready to get this thing done. A little highlighter on the nose. Cute, cute. I still love, I love to do my little highlighter and stuff. I love for the skin to just be glowing. That makes it look yummy and healthy. And you know I, I, I'm a lotion fanatic. I have to put on lotion. And that's one of my favorites there, the Avon Senses. This is the vanilla coconut, something like that. Smells so good, so good. Had to put that on my hands, honey. I guess it's time for some lipstick, is it not? Yeah, well, I'm getting the lips ready. Just take off my little lip balm I had on. And this dress, me and it, we're gonna fight. We're gonna fight, okay? I'm trying to show my cleavage. Stay put gotta figure out what lipstick oh y'all can kind of see the dress there she fitting she fitting yes she is yes indeed had a little belt to go with it yeah she fitting honey oh yeah but you know it's not too small it's just the bust area um, I can zip it up but I would love for it to be a little bit more looser there but maybe it's just the way the dress is made And now for the lips, yes indeed. I'm putting on some red lips this time around. I couldn't see what that said. Hopefully you caught it. If not, it'll be down in the description box for you to check out. Oh, I had to go back and look at that. That was matte confident, a Milani lipstick. Honey, honey, love it. Love red lips during this time of the year, especially. I always think about red lips. Even if I don't wear red, the, my red is the red lips. That's it, okay? I love red. One of my favorite colors. One of my favorite colors, red, black, yeah, white, yeah. That's about it. <laughs> oh yeah. I love it. I love it. And I'm not wearing lashes here lately. Have y'all noticed that? I've kind of done away with my eyelashes because, just because, I'm really, I'm really just trying to work on a signature eye look for me without the eyelashes. You know, that's just one extra step in your old age you don't want to have to worry about. So, okay and now of course i'm just trying to get this hair you know fluffed out a little bit it was a little bit damp when i first sat down so it's kind of dry just a little bit and um i can fluff it out and do what i do with it do what i do and yes your girl is growing this hair um trying to hold on to it as long as i possibly can to see what kind of length it's going to it's gonna have on it because it has been years years oh my gosh I want to say what 17 18 years or more since I actually had length on my hair it's been that long and y'all your girl is finito And beautiful babes that is it for today i'm super excited again that you decided to come hang out with me if it's just by chance if i popped up on your notifications whatever the case may be i'm glad you're here but if you have not subscribed why don't you consider doing that right now subscribe hit the post notification bell so that way it won't be just by chance the next time you'll get a ringy ding ding that your girl has uploaded another video i am super excited it is almost the end of the year what are your plans talk to me down in the comments and make sure you introduce yourself so i'll know who my beautiful babes are thank you so much and remember to keep your hair your face your hands and your feet looking gorgeous see you soon bye